Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here today with a quick little haul from Tom Thumb. Depending on which region of the country you're in, it's also Albertsons or Randall's. But I ran in because there was a couple of things that I wanted to get, and then I happened to peruse the aisles and found some pretty good deals, so I wanted to share them with you. So, um, my husband likes tropical drinks and I found these large 38 ounce containers of juices for a dollar a piece. So that was a really good deal. So I got him a pineapple coconut nectar, a pineapple nectar and a mango nectar. And then I found some excellent deals on meat. Um, I really don't have any room in my freezer for this. So I'm gonna have to rearrange stuff but um, I wanted to show you guys. So, and that's my nine month old in the background. I'm sure you can hear him, but this is a large value pack of pork chops. And so the meat was 50% off. And so you can't really see it, but it was $6 and 17 cents. So I paid $3 and some change for that. Then I saw this chicken. So the low price was $6.43 and I paid half of that, $3 and something. And this is for two pounds of boneless, skinless, marinated chicken breast. And then I saw this. This is almost four pounds of chicken. And so it was half, of, half off of $7.36. I also grabbed this package of boneless, skinless chicken thighs. The price was $7.68, I paid half of that. And then um, this chicken deal wasn't as good as this one, but I didn't see another package of these. But this was half off, so this was $2.99 per pound, and um, this chicken was $1.99 per pound, so see, it wasn't that as good of a deal as this one, but it was still a good deal. So I got, um, let me see, almost, so three and a half pounds of boneless, skinless chicken breast for 10.35 and I paid half. So I paid $5 and some change for this. So what I'm planning to do, because I have um, one of those food savers, I'm planning on repackaging this stuff for, you know, meals. So I've got that. Then I got some stuff for Harrison, who is our nine month old baby. He is the pickiest eater. I just thought babies when they could finally eat, which he can finally eat table food now, I just thought they would eat. Nope, it does not happen that way. So I'm trying to find different things that he'll like. So he is teething. So I got him these banana rice rusk and uh, just to see if he'll like them. And then he had a visit with the pediatrician and uh, we mentioned that we've been trying to give him chicken and things like that. You know, of course we soften him up, but he doesn't like them. So she suggested getting these little meat sticks. So I found a turkey one and I found a chicken one. To me, they look like little Vienna sausages, but we'll see. I'm just trying to get the little boy to eat something because he's a tough one. And then I've never given him a banana. So I'm gonna let this ripen up a little bit and um, chop it up and give it to him. Like I said, I, he's a tough one. I just thought, you know, you always see little babies sitting in their high chair eating Cheerios and bananas. That has not been my experience. So hopefully that'll work for him. Um, Howard and I both like broccolini and there is a recipe that I make that calls for broccolini. And I actually made it on a what's for dinner video not too long ago and I'll link it for you guys. Um, but it's really good to use um, Italian sausage and you use broccolini and pasta, it's a really good dish. So I got two of these because they were buy one, get one free. Another thing that I've talked about a lot on our What's For Dinner videos is this DiGiorno crispy pan pizza. Howard and I really like this a lot. Um, fortunately for me, I did find this on sale for half off of that $8.99, so it was about $4.50. Now, I don't know if that means that they are discontinuing these pan pizzas, and I hope not because I love them, but I got two and I've gotta figure out a way to get it in my freezer. I had a reward for a free signature Supreme pizza, so I grabbed that and it's going to expire 
the reward was going to expire pretty soon, so I had to get it. And then I've also talked about these what's um, these garlic toast on our what's for dinner. We love these things. They were on sale today, so I grabbed a box. And by the way, our what's for dinner videos come out on Tuesday. So if you're interested, please subscribe and you can check those out as well. I had a coupon for this ice cream and I decided to give it a try. It sounds really good to me. It's almond ice cream with brown butter sauce and milk chocolate in a milk chocolate shell. And there are actually chunks of almond in this ice cream. So I really like ice cream that has stuff in it. I don't really like a smooth ice cream. So I like nuts or something in my ice cream. I grabbed some fresh mushrooms because I plan on making some mushroom fried rice. And then the last thing that I picked up from Tom Thumb um, are these pistachios. And so if you had your reward card, um, the 16 ounce bag of pistachios they were $4.99, which is a really good deal. I probably did not need to get them because I am allergic to pistachios. I actually have to take a Benadryl and gargle with salt water after I eat them, but it's worth it. It's worth it. All right, so this is all that I picked up. Like I said, it wasn't a lot, but these deals are so good. I just had to share them with you guys. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, I certainly hope you'll do so. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.